Hello everybody and welcome to the final part of Afraid of Monsters. Something I didn't know, we've already actually locked ourselves into the ending that we're gonna get. Um, the, the, the ending, if you remember the bit in the subway where we got ambushed, that's where the ending is decided. Hello. My name's Kirsten, by the way. Hello. Nice to meet you. I hope you have fun here. This doesn't look safe. Are we going back into the beginning? If. A code of ten numbers. Is it worth it? Oh, is this what all those notes are for? Wow, hello. So I have no idea what... So we, we have an R4, and we got two others which I can't remember right now. But I think you have to go down the other ending routes to find out the rest of the code. Hello, sirs. I, I'm assuming that the it'll spell out a word. You're not impressing anybody, lady. I'm assuming it'll spell out a word or a phrase or something. Hello. You're looking mighty translucent today, sir. Get on the floor. All right. Well, this isn't very friendly. I see you. I don't know what bit of you I'm shooting at. It doesn't seem to be very effective. Oh. Well, he's dead now, so it doesn't matter. There's something twitching very rapidly. There you go. You just see it through the thingy. This, um, just as, as an aside, this level is called Heaven. <laughs> For whatever reason. Um... If if heaven is a wooden shack that's bleeding from every every orifice, do shacks have orifices? <laughs> then I don't want to know. I don't want to go there. Fuck that shit. Okay, that's a bottomless pit of death. It's not like the other area that we just went to, where it isn't a bottomless pit. The black bit is a safe path for you to walk on. No, here it's just death. Ooh, there's health over there. I want it. Give it to me. Before I press the button of inevitable demise. Hello! Well, fair enough. Guess we're going up the mysterious ladder thing. God, this is kind of freaky. I don't like bottomless pits. At all. In any game. They always freak me the fuck out. No, when I played the Bugs Life game, I played it on PC, but it was on uh, PS1 and Nintendo 64 as well. That one, the 3D platformer one. Um, it had bottomless pits that caused me to stop. I, I wouldn't be able to finish certain levels because they had these big old bottomless pits that were like smoking and it creeped me out so much. Well, hello there, cages. Oh, we're going up. Nah, I don't trust it. Get to the end before you get crushed by a cage. It's so sweet of these cages to act as lifts for me. That one has a man with a bag on his head in it. I killed a man with a bag on his... Hello. I see you there. Well, that didn't work. Shit. Oh my god! <laughs> oh dear. There are at least 30 head crabs there. I counted. So. Oh shit! Ah no! Oh, it's fine. Cause that's, that's, that autosave is really fucking me slightly. Cause if I hold down W, I'm just gonna just go walk straight off the pit. That suck. Dodging time. Oh my god! Okay, three hits and I die. I made a quick save because I'm a horrible save scum cheater bastard. Uh, I can use my shotgun. Uh, 
I swear I, I'm okay at video games. Oh my god! Oh, They stay on the floor! And I'm so tall, I trip over them. And then I die. It's so sad. Ah, I get fucked. Die. Gee away. Is that meant to be go away or get away? What's this shit? Now where are we? Wow, look at that. You can see the top. Ooh, another creepy corridor. Is this gonna be... <laughs> that second one looked really funny. I bet that was like one of the developers or something. Oh, hello gate. Hello horrible monsters. Go away, shoo. Get out of here. No one loves you. Wow, oh, this axe normally kills things really easily. These guys are not so much, apparently. What's this? A button. And some ammo for guns I don't have. <laughs> God, I, sh I, sh I really should have kept one of those other guns, shouldn't I? That would have been sensible. But I am not sensible. If I was sensible, I probably wouldn't be... Balls! I wouldn't have done that, that's for sure. Jesus. Go away. No one loves you. We've been through this. <laughs> I love the way they jump like that. It's almost comical. Why are you not dead? Why are you still not dead, you wank? I ain't gonna get through this area on one health. Maybe I am. Ladders are so scary. Get out of here. Alright, do I have anything in terms of ammo at all? No. I'm down to an axe. Sorry, I'm concentrating. They're invisible bastards here. Piss! I saw him too late. Oh, they're so difficult to see. I have a feeling they're not going to be picking up on YouTube at all, so it, it just looks like I'm flailing wildly, which I pretty much am, to be fair. Button. Yes. We have done well today. Where do we go now? Do you want the gates open? Is this the correct direction? It's the direction I'm going in. Oh, piss off! Wank! Oh, it's fine. I guess I just do this bit forever. This is my purgatory. Why are these lights stapled everywhere? And why does it look like we're just in a like weird bush? Go away. Go away. Oh, these guys are so annoying to kill with um, melee. Oh, come at me! You're not so tough now, are you, motherfucker? Now your giblets. Delicious, delicious giblets. No! Don't do that. Piss! Wank and piss and balls. That sounds like a good Friday night. Oh god, Jesus fuck. Come on. I will not be bested by you. I hope I get a better gun at some point. Why are you standing perfectly still? You're unsettling me, child. There we go. I'm gonna quick save. I'm gonna be abusing quick save just because I have one health and there's nothing I can do about it. Where are we going? Ah, into the toilets. Sounds like fun. I have shotgun now, so I should be okay. Oh, come on. Rawr! Ooh, here's another bit. M12. Why are the why are there toilets in hell? Heaven. We're in heaven. 
Surely in heaven no one needs to poop. Wait, what? Oh, this is open now. Yeah, we came through there. We went in there, we did some shit. Then we fell down a hole in the ceiling. Now we're back here. Good. Now that we're all caught up. Are you meant to be this hard to see? See if you are, you're a twat. It's easier to see when it's dark for whatever reason. I can see one. Oh, it's you! Oh my god, How these things kind of fire randomly. I have no idea how to deal with them. I'm just going to go for it. Ah! Okay. Up until the point, that was working. Go, 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 go. Jump. Go, 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 go! Go! Faster, you wanker! Are we safe? Did we survive? That's a fuckload of ammo, so... Oh, this is ominous. Let's ascend further into heaven or hell or whatever this shit is. Ow. Can you go away? Oh, are we following red dots again? Oh, I don't like following red dots. Oh, Toucan. Why do we have to follow the red dots? This is the most unsettling thing about this game. Ow. I didn't follow the red dots very well. Where's the next one? Ow! God, I'm bad at this. Dot. Dots. What? What? Oh, I'm monkey barsing it all. Oh. This is fucking weird! Ooh, what's this? Hello. What are you? I pressed a button and it summoned a monster. Oh. You can climb now. That's exciting. Ooh, you're really speedy, Twitch fans. I should probably be using guns. Oh god, there are so many of you! <laughs> oh, that was a bit... Oh, it's put me back here. Now I wait for people to climb up. Ow! Okay, so hitting them makes them immediately pop through. That's good to know. Ah! Oh, this isn't nice. Oh, this is really bloody difficult. Go away! Don't all of them? Oh my god! Why are you floating? What am I supposed to do about this? Can I get out? Okay, okay. I'm gonna do a quick save because I don't know if that was meant to happen. But I'm doing it anyway. Oh, I hate following the dots. What the fuck? Oh, I don't want to do that. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, why? is when I'm in a completely black space, I think it is. That freaks me out. I got through the entirety of Amnesia not being at all scared. But this, for some reason, is freaking me the fuck out. And I don't like it. Oh, God. Okay, I ate a piece of licorice and now I think I'm going to be okay to go forwards. Okay, I'm hiding behind the two can fuck this shit. Oh my god. Why am I going towards the light? I never got to the light. That was anticlimactic. That's the police. Am I not in heaven anymore? What's happening? Oh, I don't trust this at all. Why do I have a 45 on my shirt? 45 watts. Oh no, he says. I'm so confused. What was that? Hello? 
Okay. Is that the end? What? That didn't explain shit. Oh my god, I'm not playing through to get another ending, because fuck that shit. But... Okay, I'm gonna be honest here, I do know what the plot of this game is. Um, in a very vague sense, because I'd, I'd heard it before I played the game. But it is an excuse plot. I've also heard that the, the plot isn't actually meant to make sense, as it were. Maybe we'll actually get something explained here, though. So I won't say that yet. Hello? Blank screen? Okay, more credits. I won't explain the plot till the end of the credits. That was fucking weird, that entire last level. I don't know. It kind of just came out of nowhere. I'm really quite confused. Ah well, whatever. The this this the developer basically was making the game, and then I think he went to his brother or something to ask for a story because he couldn't think of a way of having all the spooky stuff happening. So it the story isn't meant to matter at all. So I don't think it matters that I didn't get the best ending or anything like that. Because the, the, there, are, there are four endings. There's this one is the first ending. Um, the second one, if you can remember, we got... We went in, into the subway station. We got ambushed by, like, I don't know, th 10, 20 people. Um, after you go out that, you go up some stairs into an area where we got a shotgun back, I think. And there were two ways. There was a corridor to the right. Sometimes the route is right. We, yeah, if, if you're going up the stairs, there's an area to the right which looks like a dead end, and there's an area to the left which we went down to get this ending. And if you go down... And in, in the area on the... I'm explaining this terribly, Jesus. Basically, there's a little area on the right of a room that has just one of the bull squid men in it. And there's a ladder there, which is quite difficult to see because it's so dark. If you go up there, then you can get a different ending. And then, there are two endings down that way. And then there's another ending. After you've beaten all the endings, you have to beat all the endings to find all the pieces of paper with the numbers and the letters on them. Then you come back to the first ending again and you go in that room in the MS Paint area and you type in a code and then you get something, I don't know, <laughs> another ending that probably actually explains what happens. Um, but I'm just going to spoil the plot. The plot is that you, the drugs that you're on are making you hallucinate horribly and all of the monsters that you're seeing are just normal people. You're just so drugged up that you're just going around murdering all these normal people but you think that they're monsters because they look a lot like monsters, and they do try and kill you, for whatever reason. <laughs> I mean, I mean, after a certain point, they probably know there's a murderer on the loose who's tr kind of going around killing everybody. But why does the first one try and kill you? That's the question. But yeah. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this. I suppose this was a very short finale. Oops. I thought there was going to be a final boss and stuff, but there wasn't shit. <laughs> And thank you so much for watching this, and I will see you all next time for another game. Goodbye. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. I um, I My voice goes so high-pitched when I get frightened by something. I don't know why. If, if I'm trying to make a noise that high-pitched, I can't do it.